Have you ever had opportunity to do something for which you felt unprepared or inadequate? I have. Some years ago, Elder Richard G. Scott kindly invited, would you like to watercolor with me? We used as a model his beautiful watercolor titled Campfire at Sunset. As we painted, we talked about faith. How as we face the light and warmth of a campfire, we leave the darkness and uncertainty behind us. How on sometimes long, lonely nights, our campfire of faith can give hope and assurance. I live in Singapore and Last week, there was crazy lightning, so much rain. The thunder was so loud. For a moment, I thought I was going to die because I was outside with no shelter. And for me, having faith in times of storm has built kind of like this small bubble of protection. I would tell those who are struggling to take it one moment at a time to reach out and see if you hear something and if you don't reach out one more time because I believe that it comes. I don't believe that it always comes immediately, but I believe that it comes. It might be a bit scary sometimes because uh, we don't see him. We're not too sure what's going on. We can't see the future and we're not too sure of the past. Trusting in the Lord timing and trusting the process is a big thing. I think the, the Savior knows all of our circumstances and he felt it and he knows how we feel. And trials are for us to, is to strengthen us. And it's for us to learn and to grow. I think the first step to faith is, first of all, to find out about Jesus Christ. Because if you don't know um, what it is that He can offer and you don't know what He's about, then probably why would you even want to have faith? It's hard to completely understand what the Savior went through, but uh, when I do feel stress or when I am struggling, that's when I think you start to understand really the magnitude of what He's gone through. So I pray to him, just like talking to another person. Though I don't see him, I know that he is there and listening. And therefore, I open up my heart and say whatever I, I want to talk to him about. I'm not the kind of people who will sit and do nothing about things. So having faith is to take action. So what I've learned from that is that you just commit, that once you get the answer, you commit to it, and that even when it gets hard, you stay committed to it. He's the Prince of Peace, and um, I think peace is one word that, that I can definitely say that he brings to me. I think that every day you just have to keep on trying to be better than you, than you were yesterday. And as you do that, you can always see progress and, and you'll see happiness each day. And the dawn does come. Our campfire of faith, our memories, experiences, and heritage of faith in God's goodness, and tender mercies in our life has strengthened us through the night.